Right. Well, I, 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 I disagree a little bit. I think he had it. His stuff was as good as velocity. He was up to, what, 95 tonight? Ball was jumping out of his hand. I thought he had a good break him on, a good changeup. Um, he wasn't able to get outs. That was the key thing. So if you want to say he didn't ha- I think his stuff was good, but they just were on it. They were on it and, um, you know, left some pitches up. Uh, he made some good pitches uh, to, you know, leadoff hitter. He, he got him, what, twice, struck him out. Um, span, and, I, you know, there were just some guys on him tonight. It was it was it was pretty impressive by them coming out and, and putting it on them. So, with the deep bullpen we have and, and Patrick being ready to go with some length, just wanted to switch it around. You know, in another situation a month ago, we'd probably leave him in there and try to get him through five innings. I saw him frustrated, Nick. I did. We talked about that and. Um, uh, you know, that's one thing. Archie Archie wears it on his sleeve. He really does. He's one of our guys. It's emotional. Um, sometimes it's to an advantage and sometimes it's to a disadvantage. So we talk about those things and trying to, you know, kind of look at, be able to look out there and not know if a guy's pitching well or pitching pitching poorly. So we we're, that's part of the coaching and the teaching that we're trying to do with him and all the guys. Um, so, yeah, you could tell tonight there was a little bit of emotion. Yeah, I would say Cruz. He went one hit through, uh, and it was a pinch hit homer. Uh, he did a great job of, of, you know, disrupting timing. We talk about that a lot with his his wind up, and he was in the wind up most of the time tonight. Uh, guys were just not able to square him up. I don't think we had many well hit balls off him. Uh, he was moving the ball around the zone, up, down, in, out, using his cutter really effectively. Um, he had a he had a big time outing tonight. And of course, when you get a lead like he did, I think he felt really comfortable. And uh, our guys got caught back on their heels, unfortunately. He threw, a, yeah, I mean, he threw a lot of pitches, and it would have been tougher, Nick, to do it if we had our bullpen a month ago and we, you know, had had some tough outings before that, you know. But at some point, you know, you do things also to flip it around for the guys in, on defense too. You know, somebody try something different, left-handed pitcher. See if that helps. And I thought Patrick did a great job tonight. Great three innings. Gave up some hits. Some guys got on, but he got the double play ball and just pitched around it. It was very impressive and felt his velocity was up also. But um, our right handers really had a hard time tonight pitching to that lineup. It was. You know, Pete, you know, he, he just does his job. He works hard during BP. Um, you know, with. Uh, Herman breaking his hand. He went to Sheryl's today and said, "Hey, I want to you know get behind the plate and be our third guy." So that was impressive. He's been working back there. You saw him between innings, and uh, when he's called upon, he's ready. And he's had some some home runs off some really good pitchers up here. So that was impressive. You're right. Were you surprised he went to Sheryl's No, because I know Pete, and Pete's all about the team and whatever he can do. And he knows, you know, in September it's difficult when you just have two catchers uh, with all the different uh, pitchers we have and pinch hitting and things that go on like that. So you want to be able to have a guy that you know you can go to that's not your shortstop or something that you have to stick back there. Right. Yeah, it's been tough here for him. I think so far, uh, hopefully we can do something to, to get him feeling good about himself and his game uh, when he before he leaves here. Uh, and I know Mike and I just talked before I came in here, and we're going to try a few things. Um, and just not really radical things, but just different ways of approaching um, each hitter and see if it works. Because obviously, it's what's going on right now. It's it's just not working. Yeah. Well, not, well, I don't want to say because let's not give it away. But maybe you'll notice. It'll be a little test for you next time he pitches.